At more than 300 kilometers in length, Alberta's Iron Horse Trail in north of Edmonton runs through beautiful agricultural area of the province and many small communities as well. And of course, what could be more iconic of the prairies and prairies agriculture than the grain elevator? Um, a symbol really of, I guess, prairies farming in all of our youth. <laughs> Those of us who grew up at a certain time, this was the symbol of where the grain was collected and loaded onto the railway cars. Well, now the Iron Horse Railway itself is gone, and so is the need for for grain elevators such as the one we see here at Elk Point. However, they have preserved theirs. I don't believe it's any longer in use, judging from the condition of the grounds around it. But it stands there as a reminder of our past, a reminder of the way we used to do things, a reminder of the way that grain and rail, as much as anything else, connected this part of Canada to the rest of the country and the rest of the world. So that's the Iron Horse Trail. And I'm doing the section between St. Paul and Heinsberg, which is the end of it that runs closest to the Saskatchewan border. One of the best of the Trans-Canada Trail.